So what's up guys, how you not doing? Welcome back, this is your boy again, I'm Slink, I hope you're not doing okay. Good morning, afternoon, evening, depending on where you guys are watching this video from. Today is Sunday, I want to apologize, this video is coming really, really, really late. You know, we have personal issues, family, money issues, uh, there are plenty, I know if you talk. But I will say you guys went to church and uh, you pray for your loved ones, most especially me. I need your prayers, guys. Honestly, I honestly, I need your prayer. And also, Bufai Father needs your prayer more. I don't understand. I don't understand. Somebody make me understand it. How is it possible this girl was able to marry this man without the concept of this man's family i thought according to nigeria tradition africa tradition the main marriage is weaknesses weaknesses from the mother's parents weaknesses weaknesses from the groom side and weaknesses from the bride side most especially the most important parties are the parents the parents must be involved in your marriage before it will be regarded as marriage to nature and if you believe in god before it will be regarded by god if you are getting married and your parents are alive and well or they are not in jail or whatever whatsoever and they don't follow you to that woman's place or to that man's side there is no need for you to marry because that will not be married so now father or father sorry father married a gorgeous fiance i don't want to say the man is irresponsible father is 38 years old and this man is 30 to 32 years old apparently but his age is dangling between 30 to 32 so we do not know his age specifically now father marry this man without the consent of his family the question is who paid your bride price is it that this man hired people to represent him as their as their son and uncles to come to your house to pay bride price who is lying against who and how come this lover was able to know so much already you know? this lover knows so much so while she was enjoying her marriage a marriage a traditional ceremony a bugwe bugwe ceremony the family of the guy released a memo online through this lover blog they said wedding of taiwo ola kita call image and videos come to our attention showing our son taiwo getting married to wofa ewa in a traditional ceremony in uge cross river state this serves to notify all acquaintances, family and friends that the cold family of Victoria Island, Lagos are not aware of any marriage ceremony of our son, Taiwo or Lankita Cole. Neither did we grant permission nor support in this regard. As much personal paradings themselves as new members of the core heritage by virtue of this purported event are not known nor accepted by the family. All publications and documents being circulated about this are to be disregarded that is engineer by engineer core for the family. Victoria Highland Lagos. okay okay well <laughs> uh 
the woman is 38 years old and uh, the guy is 30 or 32 years old love is blind i understand that uh, you can you you cannot tell someone where to get love from love is blind but if indeed this story is true sorry to say father you are not married this is just a sham somebody is deceiving somebody there cannot see me again well i've seen it before one of my friends married a girl none of his family member came there none things are not going bad for them or as far as i can i can tell things are not going bad for them now they are living well as far as i can tell and they have they are they do not have like two kids well how we understand marriage marriage the main marriage is between parents the parents of the girl will give their daughter hand to you to marry and they are not even giving their daughter to you they are giving you their daughter to your family so your father your mother your siblings uncle or whatsoever must be there except if you are deceiving yourself that is not marriage though. in the sight of the lord that's not marriage that is an arrangement it's not marriage but that being said let me know exactly how you feel about that gist that's what's going on now. and then let's go back to mercy josie tuntu dk angela uh, angela uh, okorio and queen habit well if numerous women are complaining about Mercy Jersey, does that mean that some of those complaints might be true? Have you guys thought about it? This one will complain, this one will complain, this one will complain, this one will complain, this one will complain. Uh -uh. Is it that some of those things they are saying might be true about? Mercy Johnson. Now, Nollywood actress Queen Herbert, he wrote this. He said, Have you guys ever asked yourself why I have never worked with Mercy Johnson apart from the movie scenes of the past pro produced by Magic Movie? She even removed me from poster, and Angela always supported whatsoever she does then. Oh, is it when my sister Cha went to beg her? I swept for her. I swear that day. When you were busy bullying upcomers with the person you are dragging today, you know, no. Both are wrong, and karma is a bitch. That is how coming from both Mercy and Okuria. He said Mercy and Shua and Pepe. Oh. You know, music in uh, sorry. A uh, Nollywood industry, any industry that there are bound to be competition. There are bound to be competition. That is normal. But it should be an healthy competition. A competition that will not require you to start doing voodoo magic. Or call it somebody rich. It's impossible eh, for America to call another America who is a Hollywood superstar a witch. Why is it that whenever Hollywood superstar want to quarrel among themselves, they can quarrel respectfully, calling each other out, but they never say the witch. Is it that only Africa now witch, witches, they exist? Now, Okoya called Mercy Josie a witch. Her husband responded, and she responded back saying, uh, Mercy Josie's husband is already placed inside the bottle. <laughs> she so it's already placed inside the bottle. But I've said it before, it takes a witch to identify another witch. And again, if if all witches in Nigeria are like allegedly like Mercy Josie, then I think Nigeria will be a good place to be. 
because many witches are set out to destroy. That's a message. Just say, if allegedly she get with you, she they use her own to build her family. Is that not a good thing? If you want to, if if, if I want to pray for my siblings to get with you, don't be the one may go to or, or, or pray for all of us are pray for. Ah. Because she's progressing, she's happy with her family, nothing is happening to her family. And they still call her witch. Ah. Oh, wow. <laughs> Let's see, call her witch. It's crazy though. So, guys, the boy again, Adam Slink. 